Welcome back to Wartime's European Frontline. Welcome to the next mission. Apparently the Germans have already landed in the UK. Well, that's uh, rather disturbing. And they have captured two of our radars. That is not good, naturally. So we have to get them back. Oh, look at those, those veteran cars. Isn't that nice? Okay, so let's get our... our resources rolling in this looks interesting we have pretty much nothing we've got one radar here and what is that yes, explore using the radar arm ah, so i suppose that is that's uh like a radar scan let's see looks like it oh cows isn't that cute in any case what we should also do is build a barracks yep let's build a barracks and also an oil rig probably so we get that get that oil that oil rolling in or flowing in anything else can we build yeah we can build towers but we probably need a defensive hq for that and we also want another supply store well i say another supply store i don't even have a supply store because we're going to hit our unit limit rather soon okay i thought it would be another air battle but evidently it is not okay let's get you set up and let's just check out the landscape it seems we can pretty much just march over here if you want to but naturally you want to make sure that we have that we have that sound like sonar but then again i have now been in the in a world war ii era radar station so what do i know anything here no this seems to be fairly open so this doesn't look too bad and they say we have to build a lot of empty aircraft batteries so our planes going to come after us because we do not have access to our airport in fact we can't even build anti-air batteries but maybe that's more for a general statement like they're not like in-game in-game in the aircraft batteries what we have here we do have the academy that needs fuel so okay so what's the deal what's the use of oil rig why doesn't this work it didn't work during the last mission it doesn't doesn't seem to work in in this one here so do oh, do we have to man the oil rig Unless, unless the, unlike the pump jack. You know what, let's actually check that before we... We do. Well, that explains it, doesn't it? I expected this to be like the German... Like the German pump jack, but it is not. It has to be manned. Why is this... Why do we even need the rig here? Because we do have... Let's get... One, two, three, four, five. I'm not quite sure whether they actually need five, but... Never mind. Yep. Completed. We we do know that now. In any case, what we also want is probably more of these here. Yeah, more of everything pretty much. But we'll get to that. And an academy and everything else. Yes, sir. Okay, so we can almost afford this. By the time we do have 50 units of oil, we probably have enough minerals as well. Yes, and there we go, indeed. I'll be honest, these buildings look, I think they look a little bit better than the German ones, but they still don't look terribly interesting. But oh well. We need probably need an academy for this. Yeah, so I do recall these guys being pretty strong. They do require fuel, so essentially like the German flamethrower guys, or the, they're the equivalent, the somewhat special infantry units, which I'm okay with. Let's build, maybe build a second tower. I just want to protect my economy here a little bit. I don't think I needed that many guys here because we seem to be queuing up quite a bit here. In fact, that guy here doesn't seem to get any action but that's okay i guess we only need oh, 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 oh. We that is not great this is in tower range but we want to make sure that they don't just just roll over us at one point we definitely want another another tower here that should protect our economic interests in this area and maybe even another one here because i, I don't really trust this also look at those trees they kind of look like tree trunks with camouflage netting over them it's kind of neat yeah i think one tower here is going to help also gives us vision and that is nice let's actually not do that let's instead fix you and i guess after that we can build another one of you and then we can start pumping out those troops do they have I didn't see any towers here so this shouldn't be too difficult but i think they did have let's actually hotkey you i think they did have 
No, they didn't have. They do have one tank here, so we're going to need a decent amount of firepower for that because tanks are a bit trickier to take out than one might think. So what's the deal here? Uh, that's a decent amount of light vehicles. Yeah, we're going to need an, a somewhat sizable strike force for this. There we go. So let's start building said strike force. And we probably want one or two more of these. Then again, well, look at that. Small motorcycles. And now they're dead. Because they're brittle. Just like everything in this game, except for the really heavy tanks. I'm not quite sure how many of these guys here I want. I probably want a couple, but they do need to deploy, so they seem to be kind of kind of clumsy in that regard. Wow, how sneaky. How very sneaky of you to take me through the forest here. You'd think the AI would just go to my base in a straight line and attack me, but that's actually not the case. But I'll take it. In the meantime, let's get a couple of you. Because I can, and then we're out of resources again. We do have all the world's oil, pretty much, and more than we can use, really. So we can get you to gather more more minerals here, even though we kind of have enough guys here as well, so it doesn't really matter. Do we want another barracks? I think that might be too expensive, and we might not gather resources quickly enough for that to be worth it. Is there anything? Ooh, look at that cemetery. Well, you know what, since we do have this neat radar here, we may as well scan that. And let's see whether there's anything in the back here. Doesn't look like it at all. Maybe here? No, it's just pastoral English landscapes. Isn't that sweet? All right, let's maybe get that barracks at one point, if we really want to. Uh, it's, it's only 100, less than the cost of four soldiers. We may as well, may as well build a second one. We, yeah, we definitely have enough resources. We start with 10,000 here, as it seems, so we're not going to run out anytime soon. If we do, we probably are too bad at this game to complete it. But I could complete the Axis campaign, so I'm confident that I can complete this campaign here as well. Construction completed. And maybe one more of you. There we go. And are we uh, still building these guys here? That's good to know. Yeah, these these guys here, they actually, we did have... No, we do, do not have the counter espionage upgrade. That's a shame. And there's one once more, two of these guys. They just roll in from off map. Maybe they do. And this time it's actually three guys. Oh dear. Well, I'll take that back. And boom. You got yourself mortared. As you should. Because that is your destiny. And so you just keep gathering. I don't think there's anything else I can build. There's the... Oh, I can actually build a vehicles factory? I did not see that. Why did I not see that? I don't know. Might not even be worth it, to be honest. Might not even be worth it. Construction completed. But we're going to build one anyway. Because if you only get... And then again, I'm not quite sure how good the British... Did they have those jeeps or were those Americans? American? I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, we're going to get that definitely now, but yeah, as I said, might not even be worth it. But but let's let's give it a shot. It costs a fair amount of resources, but then again, so does my army, so I probably shouldn't complain about that. And almost there, just a little more, and there we go. All right, so I take that back. We do have vehicles here. I did not pay attention to that at all, hence I did not see those coming. Okay, great. Now we have. So let's actually turn you into two different groups, a mortar group and a regular rifleman group. Then let's see whether we can take out a couple of these guys while our factory is being set up. Yeah, I'm not quite sure whether factories really have a... Well, not factories. Ve light vehicles really have a better ratio of like, firepower and cost. I don't think they have. Also, a Dutch windmills from the Operation Market Garden map. What we have here? Oh dear, that's actually... Uh, yeah. You're still going to lose this. But you're not going to lose this as dramatically as as you could. In any case. Let's see what we can get done here. I, th I thought there was an ostrich for a moment, but it probably isn't. 
Okay, everybody attack the tank. That's clearly the, the, the hottest target here. And then you can take out all of those guys. I think we can manage that. You can take out these sidecars and you mow down those guys. That is a lot more stuff. What else? Oh, that's a, pan that's a panzer too. Uh, that's uh, more stuff than I care to admit I was expecting here. But it might still be okay. We just have to see. There we go. Yeah, I think we might still be able to take this. But we also have to hope that they don't take more. You are not particularly effective against infantry, are you? No, you're not, and which is why you're all dead now. Uh, sort of won this, but not really. I think you guys should just go back to the big graveyard for a second. This still isn't ready, but that's okay. In the meantime, we can build a bunch more of you. There we go. And maybe one or two more of these. And then let's, let, let's just roll in some reinforcements. Yeah, against the tanks, I'm not quite sure whether the light vehicles even would have fared better. And also, let's see how expensive these are. Which we will find out soon once this building has actually finished. So we do have the Humber Mark 1, and we do have the transport truck. Okay, can that transport truck attack? We'll find out soon. Otherwise, I don't think this guy is even worth it, because that's the... I mean, it does cost fuel as well. For two of these, I get like almost seven soldiers. Might not be worth it. To be yes, honest, sir. might not be worth it. Well, couple more of you, and let's see whether that transport truck is. Wait, didn't it? Oh, yeah, there we are. Didn't set I get. Didn't set a gathering point here. Well, looks like you can't even attack. That's a bit of a shame, but what can you do? In any case, you join these guys here, and then we're going to take back that radar, and then we're going to take back that other radar. In the meantime, you repair yourself. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it. We're just going to build more of you. And then more defenders for you as well. And then we're just going to beat them with numbers. That always works sooner or later if you have enough resources. Okay, time for you guys to die because you couldn't be bothered to join that fight previously. There we go. And that mortar shell fell in a way that looked like you exploded. Okay. There we go. Got that sorted out. And then let's actually... Why am I even scouting with these guys here when I have a radar myself? Or two radars in this case. Okay, so here's a... Okay, so they don't seem to have more tanks here. They just seem to have light vehicles. We still want to make sure that we... That we have enough firepower to stop them. But we generally should be good here, I think. A couple more of you, more of you. And oh, well, didn't see you there. I think you came from off map, didn't you? Wow, you just mowed down all of these. Jeez. That wasn't nice. And there we go. That wasn't nice at all. But it's okay. The, we've got more guys where those came from. And what's the deal here? Oh, really? Oh, so they're bringing in more guys after this. I thought they would just... This was basically it, but evidently that's not the case, but that's all right. And we probably are not allowed to lose that building. That's okay too. Let's just fling a couple of grenades at you, then everything's going to be all right. There we go, got our group of rifle guys here and got our group of mortar guys here. There's more Germans coming, but that's okay. Let's get over here and yeah, you'll be fine. As long as it's those ominous groups of three, we're generally fine. And you can join us here as well. Okay, so let's get this let's get this wrapped up, otherwise this is never going to end. How how quickly do you fall against mortars? Pretty quickly. Is the answer here? Yeah, there shouldn't be too much of a problem unless they suddenly send in a bunch of tanks or so. Which it may vary well, but I think it's unlikely. And if you guys could actually set yourself up properly, this would be even better. There we go. Yeah, the blue Germans look a bit more convincing than the than the green Germans, in my opinion. There we go. And oh, we actually lost a bunch of guy, a bunch more guys here than I thought, but it doesn't matter. Or does it? What do we have here? Oh, it's the planes. Oh, careful here. 
Well, so we didn't really win that battle, did we? Select the airplanes to face the enemy air force. Okay, so where where even are my airplanes? Oh, there we are. Okay, can we can we please select all of these? Thank you. So let's. So can we build anti air now? It doesn't look like it. There we go. And then let's take you out. Let's focus fire here. And we should probably send a bunch of guys after you. So let's build a couple more. And let's hope you go down quickly. Do we get more of these guys after after these guys here run out of fuel? That's a question. In any case, please shoot these down. That'd be really nice. What do we have here? Spitfires? Spitfires, yeah. And almost there. Come on, this guy here is almost down. There we go, and then this guy here is next. In the meantime, you can take out this guy here, because this guy here is almost dead anyway. And so is my radar, which is a bit of a shame. Oh, oh wow, this guy, here is, this guy here knows the plan. That's a bit disturbing. And there we go, everybody's dead, as they should be. And we've won anyway, so it didn't really matter. Well, that was the total of eight planes, including enemy planes, so the, the Battle of England here was slightly less exciting than I expected. But that's okay with me. Thanks for watching and see you next time.